peace peace y'all welcome to another astrological astronomical update with your girl sunshine monet l today is tuesday march 14th 2023 happy pie day y'all we started the day off with a 60 percent wanting gibbous moon still in that moon the cleansing the moon rising at 1 49 a.m and we'll be sitting at 10 58 a.m we are in the sagittarius zodiac energy we are in the fourth house with the moon so this sagittarius energy is applying to our communication skills in our home and our family and how we protect those things and also tapping into the divine feminine energy because that is the scorpio house and right now in the tropical chart that house is being ruled over the transformational energy of scorpio and then the vedic chart which is your emotional self that house is being ruled over by libra energy being in the balance and the fairness to the home and transformational energy to the home with this moon the sun rising at 7 12 a.m and will be setting at 7 5 p.m moon and ant aries will be at minimum angle at 8 39 p.m the moon will be 1.4 degrees north northeast conjunction will occur at 8 12 p.m with the moon 1.4 degrees north and we'll be able to observe that at 2 19 a.m with a 3.6 east separation and for those of you guys who don't know and aries is located at the heart of the scorpius constellation it is a red and green color star giving off the energy of mars and jupiter so we soften up the mars and saturn energy bringing the discipline and the challenges and now we're bringing the generosity and the wisdom with those new beginning energies into your intuitive spirit the last Pluto moon will be rising at 10 9 p.m neptune will be entering the pisces constellation around 12 o'clock p.m the neptune will be at zero degrees zero latitude pisces mars will also be entering the gemini constellation today at 7 p.m eastern standard time and it will also be entering that 11th house energy of humanitarian pursuits and what you do for your community and uh, how you socialize with those around you so very exciting energy we got some major major transits happening today for my earth energies make sure y'all get y'all rest for those of you guys who have neptune and mars in your earth placement for those of you guys with fire energy and your neptune placement learn how to cool yourself that's what these experiences are going to be happening in your subconscious mars if you got that fire energy just still know how to cool yourself because your challenges in that space is going to be the air and how you utilize that air to your fire are you going to direct it to destruction or construction it's up to you um for those of you guys with uh water neptune and pisces expect lots and lots of downloads um for those of you guys with uh what's what's the next one i did fire earth air water that's it right yeah um, for those of you with water and your Mars placement, um, be mindful of how this water, this air energy is going to direct you in your space and how you're going to utilize that to bubble you up. Are you going to use it to drown yourself out in emotion or are you going to use that to motivate you? So that's the energy that we have for us today. I'm very excited about it. And here's what else you can expect on this uh, day of Ogun. Ogun not only rules over Tuesday, but also rules over your solar plexus chakra. And in our thought process, we're building with our community to our successful self and achieving. And over in our Vedic chart, how we feel about things, we're definitely trying to bring in those pinnacles and success. Now, over in our feminine side of our solar plexus chakra, we're taking our wounds into a superpower with that divine feminine energy and letting it bring us wisdom and generosity, bringing us towards our passion. And of course, those pinnacles and expansion. And also on the outside, it's applying to our fourth house of home and family. Here's some zodiac energy of other cultures, what they have on your altar during Pisces season on a Tuesday and under this last quarter moon of transitional energy. Also to reminding you to go nominate your healers on lessnobodyscollection.com. And also we're starting open enrollment for Cosmic Nobody's University. Learn how to do what I do. Make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel.